everybody. Hallelujah. Thanks for jumping on board as we release the words of healing. Amen. Words of knowledge. I believe today God is going to heal. I fact, I don't believe. I know. I know today God's going to heal. Why do I know that? Because he said his word does not return void. He also said, when you go into the city, pray for those who are sick. Heal those who are sick, actually, is what he says. Heal those who are sick. Preach, declaring the kingdom of heaven is at hand. See, there is a prophetic declaration that says, in fact, he says, when you go into the city, preach, declaring the kingdom of heaven is at hand. That was the first commandment. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. So I've released that over you. As you're watching this, the kingdom of God is at hand. That means it's available. If you need healing today, it's available for you. And I believe the word of God when he says, by his stripes, we are healed. Amen. He also says, if you're sick, come, let the elders pray over you. And the prayer of faith will heal the sick. There's so many promises in the word about healing. His desire to hear, his care for you. He wants to hear your prayer and heal your diseases, heal your infirmity. Amen. Will you cry out today? Will you say yes today, Lord, is my day. Amen. And I believe that's where we come in. I believe we come in with a place of just praise and thanksgiving, worshiping God. Hallelujah. The one who holds the sun, the stars, the moon in place, the one who does all things in perfection, says, I want to heal your body. I sent my son. And I want to talk about this. You hear, if you follow me here on theprophetshow.com, and if you haven't, be sure to sign up. If you follow me here, you hear me talk a lot about the whipping post because he went to the whipping post before we went to the cross. I remember, now I've been taught about the whipping post and by his stripes were healed, but a friend of mine named Robert Bufkin really brought this to a revelation that he went to the whipping post first. He could have went to the cross. He could have died for you without having to go to the whipping post. The whipping post, stripe by stripe, one for one, you are healed in Jesus' name. And you know what? I could probably end this episode there. Would you say an amen? And you're going to feel the power of God. But we're going to release the word today. Amen. So I want you to do something. I want to pray over you. And I want you to post your comments below. If you have any, if you have a sickness, a disease, if it's arthritis, if it's heart disease, blood pressure, um, Oh, I see a spirit of leukemia. We rebuke leukemia in Jesus' mighty name. Blood be healed. I want you to post any disease, any infirmity, any sickness below. Um, oh, it's a respiratory issue. And there's someone with a, like an inner ear issue. It's been causing a lot of vertigo. It's been causing sickness. We rebuke that right now. We rebuke the infirmity. And we say be healed in Jesus' name. I want you to post your needs below and i want you to do something i want you to also as you post yours i want you to read others the bible says pray ye one for another that your prayers may be answered so first i just want you to pray father god whoever is watching this that needs healing we speak healing into their body now we release the kingdom of god into their body in jesus name we plead the blood Amen. Did you pray that? Because I'm telling you this, we're two or three touch agreeing. Amen. Hallelujah. So God, we thank you that we're calling out corporately. Whoever's watching this and needs to be healed, we release the blood of Jesus. We say be healed by the authority of the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Wow. Now, if you're watching this, hallelujah, if you're watching this and you need to be healed, and I want you to do something. I just want you to just open up, hallelujah, open up your hands, just close your eyes if you can, amen, and just say, Lord, I receive. This is a receiving. This isn't time for you to pray. You've prayed. The Lord has heard your prayer, amen. Now it's time to receive. Wow. Amen. So, Father God, I speak over the one watching this that needs healing in their body. I speak over their body by the name and the authority of Jesus Christ, and I command any infirmity, any sickness, any disease, any discomfort, I command it to go in the name of of Jesus Christ. I command sickness to leave. I command disease to leave. I command any spirit of any unclean spirit, any spirit of infirmity, any spirit of oppression, we command you to leave in the name of Jesus. And I, hallelujah, I speak healing. I say to the body, be restored. I say to the body, be restored right now. Miracle signs and wonders. As I release this word, I know the Lord stretched forth his hand, hallelujah, to confirm the word, because his word 
does not return void. Stretch forth your hand, Father God. Complete the work. Holy Spirit, we thank you for what you're doing in the body of the believers. We thank you. We say more, Lord, more. Hallelujah. We thank you. Some of you watching this, you're feeling, literally feeling the fire of God upon you right now. Hallelujah. We speak to that inner ear. We say, be restored in Jesus' name. Vertigo, go. Vertigo, go and never return in Jesus' name. Jesus, hallelujah. We thank you. I speak to the Spirit. I speak to the spirit and the root of cancer and leukemia, and we command you to leave in Jesus' name. I speak and I command you to leave in Jesus' name. And I say, body be restored, health be restored, energy be restored. Hallelujah. By the name and the blood of Jesus Christ, we receive. Hallelujah. We receive healing, Father God, because you went to the whipping post and you took it. You took every disease, and if you took it, we don't have to have it, Jesus. So we say thank you. We honor you, Jesus, for what you've done in the body. We honor you, Holy Spirit, for bringing miracles. You are a great God. You are a God of miracles, and we honor you and we bless you. I speak life in everyone watching this. The Bible says the same spirit, the same spirit that raised Christ from the dead lives within your mortal, lives within you and brings life to your mortal body. Amen. Hallelujah. So receive it on earth as in heaven in your body today. Wow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. I want you to do something. If there was an infirmity in your body, lay hands upon it right now and say, I just receive. I receive in Jesus' name. And just begin praising the Lord. Thank the Lord for your healing. Satan, you remove your hand. Remove your hand. Spirit of infirmities, go. We plead the blood. Wow. They say, Lord, since if you're watching, they say, Lord, I received the blood and I received the healing that was bought at the whipping post in the cross. Wow. Amen and amen. Come on, guys. Post your testimony below. Did you feel the fire of God? Has he healed you? Has he healed you? If so, I want you to post it below. I want you to go to thesecondadam.com. On the second Adam, you can put your praise reports, counseling testimonies. But also at thesecondadam.com forward slash prayer, you can put in your prayer request, and you can put in your praise reports. Amen. Wow. If there was a tumor, there was a lump, there was something, I want you to put your hand on it. And watch as God just removes it, takes it off your body. I believe that. I believe that. Because I know this isn't about Wayne Sutton. It's about Jesus Christ. Amen. Lifting his name upon high and all that he's done. Wow. Share this. Somebody needs to see this. Somebody needs to see this today. Share this. Hit this share button. Share this episode. If there's any sickness in your body, say, Lord, thank you for healing me. Thank you for healing me. Amen and amen. Spirit of pain, go in Jesus' name. Spirit of life, spirit of healing, spirit of wisdom come upon hallowed the people watching this today. Amen and amen. Jesus, we honor you. Lord, we thank you. We praise you. We worship you. Holy Spirit, have your way. Heavenly Father, thank you for making the way for us to receive divine healing. Amen and amen. Guys, do me a favor. If you felt the power of God, if you felt like you were healed, if you have physical hallelujah ailments that have left your body, let us know. And you, know, you can always go back, hit the rewind. That's what I love about these episodes. Hit the rewind button. Hit the refresh button. Watch this again. Be healed in Jesus' name. Be here tomorrow, Saturday. We're going to be here Saturday and Sunday. We're here seven days a week to bring you the prophetic word of the Lord. Amen. Theprophetshow.com. This is Wayne Sutton. I believe in you because I believe in the Jesus Christ within you. Have a great day.